Hi everybody, I'm Susan and in this video we'll be looking at problem number 45 from test 4 in your red book. So go ahead and pause the video for a moment and look at that problem now. Now I have to tell you, I've had a lot of students tell me this is one of the ugliest problems and they hate it and it messes with their mind and that's all okay, but I have good news for you which is that there's really not a lot of complicated math involved and the other good news is you don't have to count back 200 on your hands to figure out what day it is because that would be really horrible. Um, so what we're going to do here is first figure out how many complete weeks are in 200 days. So it's probably going to be some number of weeks and a certain number of extra days. So let's start by doing 200, which is our number of days, divided by 7, which is, of course, the number of days in a week. And when you do that, you're going to get 28 point something or other. So this point something or other is some portion of a week. It's a few days. So we don't know how many yet, but we're going to say 28 weeks, complete weeks, have happened between now and 200 days ago. So then what I'm going to do is 28, the number of weeks, times 7, and that gives us 196 days. So 196 days ago, it was also Tuesday, because that was 28 complete weeks ago. So since 196 days ago was Tuesday, all we need to do now is count back a few days to figure out what day of the week it was 200 days ago. So if 196 days ago was Tuesday, 197 days ago was Monday, 198 days ago was Sunday, 199 days ago was Saturday, and here's the big money, 200 days ago was Friday. And that is option D.